It feels like becoming an entrepreneur aside academics is never going to be possible when you're in school. Mainly because we feel that we are young and we don't have the resources and the guts to be one. But if you believe in yourself and you have the passion to become an entrepreneur, then you already are. Staying ahead in a highly competitive environment requires applying creativity and innovation to every aspect of your journey to becoming an entrepreneur. Presently, entrepreneurship is driven by creativity and innovation to attain business objectives. The explosion in technology, business, entrepreneurship and consumption in this new era is as a result of the ongoing application of innovation. Milton Bell once said, if opportunity doesn't knock, build a door. So if you are ready to be an entrepreneur, we are ready for you. This Made in Alumni Homecoming event. It's great to see you all. And I must say that you all look splendid. When I notice some of you, the kind of beers that you have grown, and uh, the ladies among you, the kind of uh, hairstyle, hairdos you have, it's just splendid. Well, this occasion of Alumni Homecoming is very important in a number of ways. First, it gives us, management, faculty, and staff, the opportunity to reunite with you as our past students and graduates. It also gives us the opportunity to obtain feedback on your ACC experience, as well as engage you in a generative conversation with you concerning your career needs and prospects. Furthermore, this homecoming is going to give you the chance to reconnect with old classmates and some of your former uh, lecturers and staff of HCC. It will enable you to experience the changes and developments that have occurred on campus since your graduation. And so, I accept my profound thanks for making time to be present here today. I mean, yesterday, today, and tomorrow. We know you have had to take time from your busy schedules to show up. But I believe the experiences and the interactions uh, you will enjoy this weekend will be of huge benefit to you. One of the important prerequisites that make a university great is to have an alumni who feel fulfilled in life. You truly hold the keys to ACC's greatness. And it is our desire and prayer to have all our graduates, wherever you may be on the globe, and in whatever career space you find yourselves. It is our prayer that you will live out the HCC core values, which we now refer to as the five C's. Five C's, namely conviction, character, creativity, compassion, and community. Though, as a burden Christian university, we are not there yet. Notwithstanding, we believe that homecoming or reunion like this is the breeding grounds to re-energize our graduates for their personal and national and global transformation. I believe you are going to enjoy the activities planned for this reunion. And as we spend time with each other, may we share the wonderful memories we have and make more enduring new memories, which we will all cherish 
Lord willing, in the years to come. So, I say, Akwaba, or I say, Wizolo, or I say, Ojeko, or if you are from the north, I say, Amalaba, or I say, Zanu, uh, Zandazua. And um, I don't know whether we have, who, somebody responded, Zenukade. <laughs> and uh, I don't think we have any of our Nigerian uh, graduates here yet. Because I learned two words. I learned that uh, in Yoruba, you say, um, we say, um, Kabo. And then in Igbo, you say, Indewo. And then in French, you say, Bonarive. God bless ACC alumni. God bless ACC students, staff, and faculty. God bless ACC management, governing trustees, and all benefactors. God bless the entire ACC family and friends. Thank you for your attention. Have a good time. Let's do it louder for our president. Thank you so much, Dr. Samochumisi Yankra, our president. It's really a good time for all of us to reconnect, as president has rightly stated. And some weeks ago, our executives, and I'm referring to the alumni executives, asked all of us as alumni body to fill out some, some Google forms, right? Just to check up on us and see how things are going with us, how we are faring, those of us who are growing big cheeks and those of us who are also just in the house, just to help us in finding our feet, like President rightly stated. This goes to tell you that Heritage Christian College is not just a place that you come to come and seek for the knowledge, but even after you've graduated and you've left, the management, right from the presidency to the very last person of the school, continue to keep you in thought and in their minds so that you will be able to become successful after so many years. And so that was the essence of that particular um, Google Forms that were sent to us to fill. And today is a very good day for that tracer studies, the results of that to be announced to us and for all of us to deliberate on to see the way forward as an alumni. And so at this point, to help us do that, we have the head of the Quality Assurance of Heritage Christian University College Mr. Derek Ohene Jemfi to help us that. Let's welcome him. Okay, good morning. Good morning. I think yesterday on my way home, I was just seeing some old students and I was so happy. It was like a surprise. I was just seeing a hand waving at me. I was just looking and saying, wow, long time. And I was so happy. I think the electricity uh, issue, the light out, <laughs> it was really disturbing us when it came back, luckily for us. So I'm really happy uh, to be here, and I'm so excited, hoping that after this, we'll do more uh, engagement uh, for the future. OK, so what we have here is just a summary of the responses that we gathered uh, from the Tracer Studies. Now, the Tracer Study is very important to get input from our students, our graduates, for purpose of reviewing our program content, uh, repositioning ourselves to meet the industry requirement. And it's one of the requirements by GTEC if you are applying for reaccreditation and also review your program to meet global uh, standard. So this is the first of its kind that we are doing for heritage. Uh, we'll be doing this over a period as we progress. We're hoping that uh, subsequently we'll be progressing. We'll be moving to higher levels in positions and establishing more businesses. So we'll be coming to you for more information about the industry. OK, so in this summary, we had 98 responses. We're hoping to get about 150 um, responses, but that is a good response for us to make good judgment. Now, the scope of what we're looking at, we're looking at the industry positioning, how our graduates are faring in terms of job placement, creating their own businesses, 
or doing something of uh, economic um, form, then the relevance of the program to the industry and also how the program is matching industry requirement. Okay, so I've given a summary here, but I think we'll go through the reports one after the other. So one area, now the section we're looking at is from 2029 to 2022 graduating class. Oh, sorry, 2019 to Drift as you transition into a new stage of your life. The future seems like a blank space until you discover the passion within. The canvas of the future is yours to paint. Welcome to a world of opportunities. Heritage Christian College, offering world class university education, training compassionate entrepreneurial leaders.